telling you. The government has a car that runs on water, man. <laughs> they just don't want us to know, because then we'd buy all the water. Then there'd be nothing left to drink but beer. And the government knows that beer will set us free. All right, you told us about the car a million times. Can you please talk about how hungry and horny I am? I wish I had a lady made of pizza. Or a pizza made of boobs. Yeah, hungry, check, horny, check. It's getting a little old, Fez. God, I feel like I'm Luke Skywalker, you know? Right when he was living on Tatooine before R2 and 3PO showed up, just working on Uncle Owen's water farm all day. Not even allowed to go to Tashi Station to pick up some power converters. <laughs> Boring. Eric, enough with the Star Wars crap. Whenever you talk about that stuff, I frown. And when I frown, my skin wrinkles. And if I get wrinkles, my free ride is over. And I like my free ride. Yeah, we get it. You're good looking. Look, doesn't anybody have anything new to say? This car that runs on water, man. <laughs> runs on water, man. Man, I just totally forgot why I was laughing. Isn't that funny? <laughs> okay, uh, no more for the cheerleader, okay? <laughs> Jackie, you seem different. I don't know if it's your hair, your outfit. Or your red puffy eyes. She's Zen, man. I'm taking her under my wing. I'm running a dojo of coolness. Jackie, demonstrate. Oogly, oogly. Oogly. <laughs> yeah, it's her first day. Your own thing that's so hip. I love salt. I like that word, hip. It kind of pops, you know? Hip, hip, hip. I can see my own mouth. You know what's beautiful? Fruit cake. <laughs> the different colored little fruits living together in one cake. I jumped out of a cake once. I also like sweet, but there's just something about salt. Hip. It starts to lose its meaning after a while, you know? Hip. It's not even a word. Guys, I gotta tell you something. I'm omnipotent. <laughs> Eric, I can't believe you knocked up a girl, too. I mean, you lose points for not doing it in a public place, but hey, give me five. Kelso, I don't really think this is a give me five moment, okay? I am really freaked out. Well, right now, I'm not so much freaked out as starving <laughs> and fascinated by your nose. Yeah, that's perfect. <laughs> You'd be amazed at what I can fit up in there. <laughs> but the important thing is that you have responsibilities now, so you got to step up like I did. Look, if you mean you stepped up on a urinal to climb out of a window to get away from the girl you got pregnant, then yeah, you stepped up. <laughs> I don't want to get into a religious argument, but my God can kick your God's ass. God is dead, man. Said so in Time magazine. No, man. I, I sat next to God once on the bus. He told me the meaning of life, and then he gave me a pretzel. So what's the meaning of life, man? Uh, yeah. I guess I should have written it down. 
But it was a good pretzel, man. Maybe this life doesn't even matter, you know? Maybe we're not even here. Or no, maybe I'm here, but you're not. <laughs> Hello? <laughs> you know what the best thing God ever did was? Boobs. <laughs> yes. And God said, let there be boobs. And then there were boobs. <laughs> Hey, if God is all powerful, can he make a boob so big that even he can't lift it? Well, that's a good question, man. I'll ask him next time I'm on the bus. I can't wait until all of Donna's giant clothes are out of the closet. I don't even go in there now. I'm afraid I'll fall into one of her shoes and never be heard from again. Well, I guess I must be Eric's best friend. Because I'm the only one that went to the trouble of getting him a birthday cake. Good Maybe we should think about getting him something else. What do you think, Puddin' Pop? <laughs> Why does everybody keep calling me that? My name's not Puddin' Pop. I've never heard that name before in my life. Foreman's <laughs> dead. Hey, if you guys think that's funny, you should hear what Stephen calls me. Calls me. He's a... <laughs> oh, hey, that's some good cake. I'm excited about marriage counseling. I'm looking forward to hearing from a third party that I'm right about everything. I want all my marriage to Eric to be magical. I know how you could do that. Marry someone besides Eric. Hey, I'll see you guys later. I got some place I really need to be. <sighs> hey guys, sorry I'm late. Got some place I really needed to be. Okay, so get this. I don't want counseling, Donna does. So we're going. I'll tell you, ever since we got engaged, she's been treating me like a, some kind of child. <laughs> oh, where's my toy surprise? <laughs> oh, Kelso, watch you with that gun, man. Oh, relax, Eric, it's not a gun, it's a flare gun. Yeah, tomorrow's flare day at the academy, so we're learning how to use these. <clears throat> Besides, they're totally safe, all they do is shoot balls of fire. Kelso, I don't think you should be playing with fire when we're all... Never mind. Man, I gotta stop hitting two circles in one day. I can swear I just saw a ball of fire shoot through this room. Zowie. This is our third circle and it hasn't calmed me down at all. I feel almost more suspicious than before. I don't wanna get sent back to my home country. If I return in shame, I'll get stoned. And then, you throw rocks at me. Everybody, just settle down, okay? Settle down! You are all losing your minds! Who is yelling? Who is yelling? We all just need to keep calm. That's it! Don't we're all gonna die! Guys, we are making too many mistakes. We need to sit down and figure this out. Okay, this is starting to feel like work, man. <laughs> Feds have ruined the circle. The circle sucks. That's right, I said it. <laughs> hey, this circle, it's the only thing that's keeping us sharp. <laughs> if it weren't for this circle, we'd have no idea that the feds were surrounding us, planting bugs everywhere, watching our every move. So I say thank you to the circle. <laughs> I just want everyone to know, I'm prepared to fight my way out of here. <laughs> Ooh, guys, Fez's concert's about to start. Which means we have three more hours without his sorry ass. Let's eat his candy. Yeah. My name is Fez. I love candy. Or good day. I say good day. Yeah. And the best part is, that idiot actually thinks I'm his friend. Like I care. I wish he were dead. Oh, hey, we should kill him. No. I got a better idea. Let's sing without him. Some people call me the Space Cowboy Yeah Some call me the Gangster of Love mm -hmm. Some people call me Maurice Cause I speak of the poverty of love <laughs> Cause I'm a picker, I'm a grinner, I'm a lover, and I'm a sinner I get my loving on the run I'm a joker, I'm a smoker I'm a midnight toker Playing my music in the sun
I will sit here, but I will not partake. <laughs> what you're doing is illegal, and it could cause my mind to drift off its main goal, which is enforcing the law. <laughs> I'd like you both to read some literature. In particular, let's take a look at uh, Be Great and Go Straight. I think that one really says it all. Hey, hey, do not throw the literature! Kelso, the fact that you're now totally lame would make me furious if I had the ability to feel anger right now. Which I thankfully don't. I am not lame. I am grown up. And when you grow up, you'll play by the rules. Which is why I am getting rid of this. What is he doing? What is he doing? Don't worry, Fez, he's just screwing around. What? Maggie! You know he has broken you? You broke hide, you son of a bitch! <laughs>